the attack. Earlier, someone called Alex, that's not his real name, but we're using that to protect him against any possible hacks, told us how he felt not being able to play his PlayStation on Christmas Day. Yeah, so uh, basically I got my... um I got a PlayStation for my birth uh, for Christmas, and I unwrapped it yesterday. And as you can imagine, I tried to to get it working uh, immediately. And uh, basically, the um, <clears throat> I tried to log onto the PlayStation network, and uh, I got an error message. And I've continued to get an error message um, for the last two days, basically. And it's been really annoying. Yeah, so, I'm sure it's been annoying. What What do you think the people that have done this? Uh, well. I, I don't, I, well, I'm not very happy with it, to be honest with you. <laughs> not at all. It's really annoying because I, I, I just want to pay a lot of money for for the PlayStation um, and, um, you know, want to be able to use it properly, and I can't, so. Yeah, of course, they're saying that it all started off for laughs, but th- this is a way of, of showing down how susceptible these companies are to hacking. They're actually doing this for the public good, Alex. Ah, well, you know, at the end of the day, I would expect Sony to have, you know, proper security in place as uh, as standard, and um, you know that that's that's all that's 